Hello. All right, so what I have here is negative 500 degrees, and what I want to do is show you how to graph this. Now, this is a diagram for you know, our certain angles in the positive direction. So if I can just kind of um, reflect that around, um, then I can do it in the negative direction. And we notice that our negative 500, that's going to be over what we have is run revolution of negative 300. So if this is now 90 degrees, 180, 270, 0, and 360. All right, so what I did is just kind of inverted everything. But remember now, since it's negative, we're going to be going in the negative direction. And that's why I did that. So obviously, I know negative 500, so I need to go at least over to 360. Again, 360 in the negative direction. And now I just need to get as close to 500 as I possibly can, right? Well, if I take 360, add another 90 to it, that's now going to be 450. And therefore, I just need to add another 50 more degrees, um, 450, 450. So that means I just need to add an extra 50 degrees. Well, 45 is halfway, halfway between 90 and 180. So it's just going to be a little bit greater than 45 degrees would be my angle um, for, five, for negative 500. And just note that the main important thing is it going in the negative direction. It's greater than one le revolution. But um, you know, negative 540 would be, uh, would be a revolution and a half. So it's not exactly there, but it's pretty close. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you sketch the angle, negative 500. Thanks.